I've got my freshly milled oat flour here, and this gives me an idea how to make a donut that's healthier and still delicious and also gluten-free. It's my baked donuts with spirulina glaze. This version, first of all, is a lot healthier. We're gonna bake the donuts, but two, it's so easy to make because you can put everything into a blender, pour it into a donut pan, and just like that, you've got fresh donuts. We have to make our batter. So into our blender, I'm using two cups of oat flour. Next thing we're gonna use is maple sugar. It kind of reminds me of brown sugar, but it's made from crystals from maple syrup. If you don't have maple sugar, you can use brown sugar. We're gonna do half a cup. I'm gonna do one tablespoon of baking powder, one tablespoon of cinnamon. That looks good. And this is my little trick. This is a great plant-based alternative for butter, coconut milk. There's coconut fat in here and coconut milk in here. It's as simple as opening the can and pouring the whole thing right into the blender. And our very last thing, it's one egg. Now it's time to blend the whole thing together. Just a few seconds on a low speed is perfect for this. And we're done. So to get our pans ready, you just need a little bit of coconut oil on the inside. It gives you that little bit of crunch. And this batter is enough to make approximately 12 to 18 donuts. So just pour and stop. And by baking it, you lower the fat content. It's not greasy. Okay, last one to fill. I'm gonna put these in the oven at 350 degrees and bake them for about 12 minutes. And I have some baking already in the oven. They look so good. Transfer them to a cooling rack so that there isn't condensation and moisture to make your donuts soggy. This is sort of the trickiest part. You wanna put the rack on the top. I think I can do this, it's still a little warm. One, two, three. They should pop out if we did this right. It's always one, isn't it? <laughs> so when this happens, pry it out. There it goes. How cute are they? But they're missing one thing, the glaze. In a bowl, we need confectioner sugar. So this is a super fine sugar that dissolves very quickly. And we need one cup. And then we're gonna need something called spirulina. It's this beautiful emerald green color. It's considered one of the most nutrient dense foods in the world. It is something that I love to add to smoothies a little bit. It goes a very long way. So what I'm gonna do is take about a quarter teaspoon and I'm just gonna shake it in. And the last thing, one to two tablespoons of almond milk and drizzle it in as you're stirring because you wanna make sure this gets to the right consistency. So this is our beautiful spirulina glaze. Take our donuts while they're still just a tiny bit warm and drizzle it or you can take a whole donut and just dip it in and flip it over. Take that maple sugar and you could just sprinkle a little bit on. Okay, let's give it a taste. Oh my gosh. It's so cakey and moist, a little crispy on the outside. It tastes like a really good donut, but I know it's full of fresh milled oat flour, the spirulina that's in the glaze, less fat, less calories, but still has 100% of the deliciousness. You have to make this. Cheers.